Dabasa Ward, a coastal gem nested in Kilifi County, has long been a haven for fisher folk communities. The abundance of marine life has sustained generations, but the delicate balance was disrupted by the rampant destruction of mangrove forests. Charcoal burning, construction poles, and harvesting wood took a toll on the mangrove forests, leaving behind a stark reminder of the impact of unsustainable practices. The community has witnessed a decline in fish populations, threatening their way of life. Tukiangalia meneo haya Mida Creek kumekuwa na upungufu wa samaki kwa sababu mikoko mingi imeharibiwa. Kwa hivyo tunataka kuregesha hali ya mikoko kama vile ilivyokuwa zamani ili kuhakikisha kwamba idadi ya samaki katika bahari pia imeongezeka. In response to this environmental crisis, the Sita Umoja Self Help Group has emerged as a beacon of hope. Comprising fisher folk from Dabaso Ward, they joined forces to reverse the damage inflicted on their coastal ecosystem. Mradi wa Kemsed wameza kutusaidia kwa kima ya 4.9 million ili tuweze kufanya mradi wa restoration. Restoration, uh, kazi yetu kubwa ni kwamba tunaweka miche ya mikoko na tumeweza kuweka miche ya mikoko uh, 78,000. So hizi 78,000 tumeziweka kwa muda wa miezi sita sahi na sahi hii miche iko tayari ya kuweza kupanda. Mradi huwa upandaji wa mikoko ni mradi muhimu katika sekta ya uvuvi kwa sababu tukijua uh, mikoko ni sehemu ambayo samaki huzalia, samaki pia uh, hukulia na Kwa hiyo ni muhimu a jamii ihifadhi mikoko kuhakikisha kwamba sehemu hizi ziko nzuri ambapo samaki wanaweza wakakuja wakazalia na pia wakakuwa katika hali ambayo inahitajika. Armed with the determination, the Sita Umoja Self Help Group, with support from the World Bank funded Kenya Marine and Fisheries Social Economic Development Project initiated a comprehensive mangrove restoration project. Katika fesi ya kwanza tumefandi vikundi viwili. Kikundi kimoja kikiwa ni hiki cha sita ambacho kinakuza mikoko kime uh, kuza mikoko elfu sabina nane na pia tukuna kikundi chengine pale marereni kinaitwa mabiko ambacho kirukona mikoko elfu hamsini. One of the components focusing mainly on giving grants to the communities and so far at the national level, the project has released 1.5 billion. I think you saw His Excellency the President giving the checks to the five counties. The 1.5 billion Kenya shillings was, has gone to 621 groups. The once depleted fish crowns now breathe life. The intricate root systems of mangroves provide a vital habitat for fish to breed and seek refuge boosting fish production and revitalizing the marine ecosystem. Mche kama wa, 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 wa kasurina, miche kama ya hii mikilifi ni mtriz, hizi ni miche ambazo huwa tunaweka na tunadistribute kwa community. Ili waende kupanda kwa shamba yao. Instead, kama mnataka kuni wende kwa, kwa mangrove, yule mwana, mwana community yuko na urahisi wa kupata ule kupata mti katika ele shamba lagi. Na Tuko tayari sisi kutembea na nyinyi kuwafahamisha. Tufanye sensitization kwa kisha kila mmoja wetu anajua umuhimu wa mkoko na misitu mengine. Beyond environmental restoration, this project has empowered the community. The Sita Umoja Self-Help Group has not only safeguarded their marine resources, but also created sustainable livelihoods for future generations. Tumebadilisha mfumo wa kufund environmental sub-projects tunazi integrate with other type of livelihoods ya kwamba kama anakutunza mkoko yuko na nafasi ya kuomba mradi mwingine kwa mfano kuna kikundi katika wa pili kinapanda mikoko pia uh, hapo hapo wanafadhiliwa mizinga ambayo pia itasaidia kukuza nyuki na kupata asali kwa hivyo wakiendelea kulinda mazingira pia kuna uh, manufaa zaidi ambayo wana wanapata si mazingira peke yake bila kupata chochote but at the end of everything ni kwamba 
hizi communities pia zinafaa zipate pato kutokana na uhifadhi wa mazingira. Levis Msumba, KTN News.